Spanish for police say they caught a pair of crooks red handed this weekend. Thousands of dollars worth of appliances and construction materials were recovered. And right now, police are trying to find out who took all of that stuff and who it belongs to actually. Our Baldwin County reporter Hal Sherrick shows us what was recovered. A Spanish Fort police officer was on patrol around 4 a.m. Saturday when he noticed a pickup and trailer loaded down with appliances and building materials driving through the Stonebrook neighborhood. Being out of place for that time of day, the officer pulled it over after seeing a traffic violation. That's when police say the passenger got out and ran. We eventually called him uh, trying to actually come out in another vehicle. Um, I guess he, he knew somebody in the area. Um, don't know that they knew what was going on but uh, we're able to, uh, with the help of uh, Baldwin County Sheriff's Office and Daphne PD, we're able to create a perimeter and we ended up getting the passenger. Brent Smith of Mobile was charged with theft of property and attempting to elude. The driver, Chad Averett, also from Mobile, was charged with theft of property. Police have identified some of the property taken from new home construction sites in the Stonebrook neighborhood, valued at more than $2,500. There was some contractor tools, air compressor, um, a lot of building supplies um, for the new construction homes. Stonebrook off Jimmy Faulkner Boulevard is a neighborhood in a country setting, that a popular area for families to move. New home construction is in full swing. Police say areas like this are tempting targets for thieves. The home builders here are grateful police drove through when they did. Anything that gets stolen off of one of our lots could set us back at least God knows how long. Like, because we have to replace that material and when we can get the material, we don't know. So it's just, it makes it very hard to keep building. Now police are hoping to find who the rest of this property belongs to. They say through their questioning of these suspects, they've determined they started their night in the Foley area before driving up into Daphne and then ending their night in Spanish Fort where their luck ran out. Now, if you think that some of this property that they've recovered belongs to you, you're asked to call Spanish Fort police. Reporting live in Spanish Fort, Hal Sherrick, Fox 10 News.